Hey, good morning. Uh, first off, my hats go off to any of those exercise people out there that do this all the time. This is a lot of work. And, and not the actual exercise is a lot of work, just the preparation and figuring it out and all those things. So we're just trying at this. Hey, um, shout out to Br Brendan. Uh, who uh, gave me an idea about r reminding me and reminding you to breathe, especially when we're doing the, the, the cruncher part we're going to do in a few minutes. And a, and a shout out to Lu Luther. Uh, I, that was a great, great response as well. And I'd, I'd love, love to hear from you. All right, now, what I'm doing right now is a squat. And, uh, you know, um, it, it, it's a great exercise. It's a full body exercise. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn and I'm going to use this chair today, just a reminder for me to how far to go down. Now you might be able to go a little bit farther down than that. That's great. But this also kind of a safety thing that if you do go too far down, you'll be able to catch yourself. Okay. I'm just going to do five. My, I'm going to, as I, as I turn, I'm going to try to push my heels into the ground. And, and I want my rear end to go back and I want my chest to be up. I want to show chest, okay? I don't have any weight or anything. I'm not holding on to dumbbells. I could. Uh, I, I could hold on to a, uh, some books or a big bag of potatoes. Um, but that, that, that'll be, you know, in, in a few days from now. This is as soon as we get comfortable doing squats. Squats are a great exercise as long as you tuck your hips, uh, move, move your rear end down, keep your chest up. All right, here we go. I'm going to count out five. Heels are pushing into the ground. My chest is up. My hands are in front and down. And I missed it. And down. And down. Stumbling a little bit. It's good for balance. Down. Five. All right. Um, I can feel that. Uh, that. That's pretty good exercise. Move my chair out of the way. Now, we're gonna try something a little different with planks today. Um, it's not our push-up day. Push-up day is gonna to be tomorrow. But uh, what I'd like to do today, uh-oh, uh-oh, forgot my phone. Okay, hold on now. Yeah, I'm not making cuts on this. This is, this is called one cut. So we're not repeating anything. So what you, what you get is what it is. All right. Now, what I'm gonna to do today on planks, I'm gonna do my minute, but at about the 20 second mark and the 40 second mark, I'm gonna go from a plank to a push up or push up position and then back down to a plank. Uh, you try that too. Um, that just adds a little bit, of, a little bit of spice to the exercise. All right, here we go. I'm gonna start in a plank and in 20 seconds, back this up a little bit. There you go. That's a lot, that was a lot of me right there. And uh, are you up on your toes? Uh, you know, your back flat. Neck should be down a little bit. Okay. All right. Now I'm going to go to a push up. There we go. All right. That's hard. Now I'm going to go back down my plank. And I'm going to hold it there. Another, another 20 seconds. Kind of gives you a little bit of variety too. Keep my neck down a little bit. All right, I'm gonna go back up to that push up. That's hard, it makes the heart beat a little bit. All right, hold it, put that down again. Doesn't really matter how long you stay up there, you're still in a plank position. And if this is a little too hard, um, you know, you can do it from your knees for a while. All righty, I think we hit our minute. Whew. All right, start with the plank. Now you know what we're going to do. We're going to roll over. We're going to do our we're going to do our crunchers. All right. Now, some people call these Navy Seals too, because you hold your feet up, which you can't see. Got to suck. It. Here we go. My feet are up. Hands over my chest. I'm gonna I'm gonna breathe in when I go up and out when I go down. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 
done. All right. Uh, that's it for today. Not much. Hey, uh, I remember, oh gosh, uh, must have been 15 years ago. Um, knew, knew this woman who had no, she couldn't get out. She was in her house, had kids, whatever it was. I, I can't remember what her reason was, but she had to stay in. And she simply ran in place. Um, seemed kind of boring, but might work. Maybe not if you live on the second or third floor of an apartment complex. You might want to go down to the bottom. But if you can't get out, running in place is a, is a really good thing. Check your Google Classroom today. I've got it, uh, an idea of a fun activity for card stacking. I mean, I learned some things I didn't know about, and, and especially about this guy. So you might want to try that out. And then the second thing on Google Classroom is just a reminder, and this would be a great time, uh, to go back into the very first lesson um, in sixth grade, it was on ecosystems, and seventh grade's on force and energy. And go back into the first lesson of each of those. And if you want to read the selection or, or listen to the selection, but then play the lesson game. Just see what it is that, that you, you remember. All right, so that's going out there as well. I'll pick you guys up tomorrow. We'll go back to our push-ups tomorrow. Uh, make sure you get some cardio in today where your heart's beating a little bit. And uh, see you tomorrow.